It has the lotion and the cup. The lotion is lightweight, fragrance-free, oil-free. The cup itself is thicker, but... Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jennifer. And if you're seeing me for the first time, you're welcome to my channel. Please do it to subscribe and also turn your post notification so that anytime I drop a new video, you'll be notified. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for being here again. And if you're watching and you're yet to subscribe, please let it touch your heart today to support me. In this video, I'm going to be reviewing the CeraVe Moisturizing Lotion. CeraVe Moisturizing Lotion is a very beautiful moisturizer that you should check out if you are looking for a moisturizer. It contains ceramides, glycerin, and hyaluronic acid. All these things are going to work together to restore and repair your skin, moisturize and hydrate. Ceramide is going to moisturize and strengthen the skin protective barrier and as well protect the skin from external aggressors such as weather and pollution. Hyaluronic acid is another transparent gel-like substance that is going to help keep your skin moisturized and hydrated. This CeraVe lotion is a very nice moisturizing lotion that you should go for if you are looking for a moisturizer. It is dermatologically tested, non-comedogenic, it's not going to clog your pores, it's very very free and lightweight. It has the lotion and the cup. The lotion is lightweight, fragrance-free, oil-free. The, the cup itself is thicker but it's also non-comedogenic it's not going to clog your pores it's not going to darken you but then it's not a lightning lotion okay like i always say if you are looking for a lightning lotion this lotion is not going to lighten you it will just moisturize you soften your skin hydrate your skin leave it supple and soft so if you're looking for a moisturizer you should go for this particular lotion the lotion and the cream what is the difference they actually contain the same ingredients but the cream is more thicker if you have a very very dry skin i would advise you go for the cream but if you have an oily skin you should go for the lotion it absorbs very very quick it's in fact once you once it touches your skin it will get absorbed into your skin immediately this lotion is richly formulated to lock in moisture into your skin so if you have a flaky skin dry skin you should go for this lotion it is dermatologically tested and it is not harsh it does not contain any harsh or harmful ingredient it's very safe for the skin if you have eczema prone skin you should go for this lotion it's kind of uh, it's more of medicine to eczema prone skin people okay the major difference is, is that the lotion is more watery while the cream is thicker it's kind of richer you know it's richer like if you have a dry skin you should go for the cream then if you have an oily skin you should go for the lotion okay so they are all dermatologically tested they are all non-comedogenic they doesn't leave any uh, greasy stuff on your skin, any greasy residue on your skin. They absorb very, very quick. They are all beautiful lotion or beautiful cream that you should go for. If you're looking for a good moisturizer that is not going to um, clog your pore or contain any harsh or harmful ingredients. The major difference is the consistency. The lotion is watery while the cream is thicker it's kind of richer okay so this too is very good you should go for either of them if you want a good moisturizing lotion i hope this review is as helpful as i want it to be please subscribe if you are yet to and also turn your post notification on always give me a thumbs up and share this video to your friends i will see you guys in my next video bye